Firefox. Here's a quick update on the Power Shelf running without a BMS. It's been going now for just over three weeks. I've been dutifully noting the cell group voltages over the seven groups twice a day, all the way down there. Um, and here is the chart. So, what we are seeing is a pretty clear drift apart. Groups one and two are sagging lower than everything else. So, at this stage, it's looking like doing without the BMS. If I left it in that way and didn't pay attention, uh, would be a bad thing. But because this is the power shelf which uses battery holders, I can actually replace cells in these two underperforming groups live. I can just yank out the lowest capacity cell, slap in a higher capacity cell, and hopefully bump these two lines back in with all the others. So that is what I'm going to do. Uh, maybe I should do that tomorrow. And then rather than just let this run until it starts to scare me, I might actually do that tomorrow. And I've also been doing the same for the small blocks, one kilowatt hour pack that I built up. And that is doing this. So this is charging during the, during the day, then discharging into my e-bike, recharging the e-bike battery at night. Sometimes we don't get any sun. Uh, but as you can see, it looks like there's a wee bit of extra spread now than uh, a few weeks ago. This group here, group 5, is obviously the strongest of the seven groups. And I think that's group 1 is the weakest. So I will keep watching that and see, see what happens. If need be, I will build up another group in order to substitute if one of them is looking a bit weak. But at the moment, they're kind of still hanging in there. I'm curious to see how long that keeps going. And also curious that this isn't behaving nearly as badly as this one. And I think that might just be the luck of the draw. And fortunately, given that this is the power shelf, I can actually do something about that fairly easily. So that is my plan. Thanks for watching. Catch you next time. Cheers. You're just too, too obscure for me.